here we have the list of all countries in the world let me show you how to convert this html table to a javascript object or to javascript array Honest rows document dot query selector on you want to get all the table rows so tr and then const gs array Here we initialize a JavaScript array to store the JavaScript objects. Now we are going to loop over the rows of this table. So rows dot for each or just simple shift enter let us also get the index so row and also the index the first item is the table head so we don't want that if i is greater than zero country info this is an object and const row items so row dot children so country info the first one is id is the index and country info the name the row items the second one the other text content so we get this text Copy Control V. The third item Population Text Content Area. and density i made a mistake instead of uh, shift enter i click it enter Have to push this object to this array so gs array dot push country info and finally console log the array console.log country list GS array now very nice
now this is our javascript object id density name population and etc you can copy this copy object for example create a folder html to gs array open with vs code countries dot gs now we have a full list of all countries in the world with their information that you can import and export in another javascript files in your programs and use however you want and whatever you want back to the console this is the code let me show you the full code control c this is for getting all the rows of the table this is your javascript array And this is how you can loop over the rows and format each row, create custom JavaScript object, and finally push the object to the JavaScript array. I hope it was helpful. Thanks for watching, liking, sharing, commenting, and being around. Have great times and hopefully see you in the next video.